Hello my dear crafters, unfortunately this week we have no tutorial because I had an accident. It looks good now but it was pretty pretty bad, very deep and I can't really bend this finger right now. <laughs> so I'm keeping my you know my crafting ideas inside for this week but I did want to come here and share with you an absolute treasure that I found. Actually I didn't find it, my sister did. Eveline, my younger sister, she got this for my older sister. And then as soon as I looked at it, I said, mm, I think you got the wrong sister. And I kind of took it from my other sister, Renata. <laughs> but I'm giving it back. But anyway, I wanted to share with you because this is an absolute inspiration for all of us, for all of us who work with paper and crafting. Daphne is an artist from um, from Ireland, from what I understand. I, I, of course, I don't know her, but she's from Ireland and she does this magazine, like I think it comes out eight times a year and it comes in three or four languages, so it's distributed everywhere. And guys, this is the most beautiful, inspiring magazine I've ever seen. And here's how I look at it. I look at this page, for example, and this page, and I see a card. This is an idea, an absolute beautiful idea for a card. You know, you tear the paper here on the top and the bottom, and you can have sentiments or a note over here in the images. It's just a work of art. She gives, let me show you my favorite artist that she features this in this magazine here. It's this artist called Mercedes Spencer. She's, she's from New England. And she does this beautiful, look at this, all these beautiful doll, uh, it miniature houses. And she, I actually just signed up for a course online to learn how to make miniature furniture because I love me. You guys know how much I love miniature. You know, I'm finishing my course for my baskets. Let me show you. I am doing a lot of baskets, but I have to say I love the miniature ones. Let me just show you one. Well, I'll show you two, actually. These are my favorite. I just, every time I make something small, I go, yeah, that's my fave. I just love miniatures. This is almost, my class is almost done, guys. I will announce here. But anyway, coming back to this, I wanted to show you the paper things that she shares with us. So, for example, she shows you how to make this beautiful, very easy to make paper birds. Let me just zoom in for you to see. It's just a knot, basically. But here's the special thing about this magazine. She actually gives you these beautiful strips here of paper. So you can make your own birds. And they're beautiful patterns. Very thick paper here. Very good quality. I absolutely love it. And it's one of those magazines that you go back to it over and over again. She gives you a lot of recipes. She talks about food, about her travels. But let me just focus on the paper stuff because that's what we come here for, right? Oh, gardening. If you like gardening, she does a lot of gardening too. But look at this. This is an idea for a card. Very simple card. Look at that. It's just some strips of paper to make a cake but again she gives you the paper and you just tear this and you can make this card very easy all you need is a nice stamp and or just hand write it she gives you some tags along the way these are beautifully made and all great quality paper and look at the next one that you are going to love these bees here so they come in fours because it's actually layered this is the base, this is the top, and let me let me show you the idea that she gives. I mean, just the back of the paper is a work of art. So she gives you the idea of wrapping and using the bee in layers like this. Remember the bee that I, I actually have something similar in my channel, you might have seen it. So she, she comes up with all these absolutely gorgeous ideas. And the last thing I want to show you is this envelope here. So she wants you to prepare this, to create this beautiful project here. She gives you the envelope, you just cut it, and then the flowers. Isn't this beautiful? I just love her design. She gives you this, I'm not going to tear it, but this is a huge piece of paper that you can use. And at the end, and she also gives you some other paper. Let me find it. 
at the end yes look at this it's one of those magazines that you're just going to have it by your you know in a craft room or front of the tv and she gives you ideas on you know how to use these papers but then she designs the most beautiful gorgeous papers look at this so guys it, this is a find and you know me if i find something that i think you guys will love i have to come here and share it actually can be i mean look at the back this is a paper in itself i, I would use this to make a box because it's a very thick paper but you can actually i was looking here so you can subscribe so i have the link below if you want to subscribe my sister found it in um in a supermarket but you can subscribe it and it comes in four languages i believe so daphne i don't know you but i am a big fan you are a beautiful artist and i hope you continue gifting us with this very oh look at these dolls with this precious magazine okay i'm a fan and i will subscribe for sure i'll give myself the gift of your diary so thank you so much guys and i'll be back next week i just have to wait until i can bend the finger okay it is what it is crafting comes with danger i guess <laughs> thank you so much i'll see you next week